Hi everyone and welcome to Creative Cakes by Sharon. If you're like me and you love those peanut butter filled pretzels, you'll know that it's virtually impossible to stop at just one or two or three or four or five. I think you get the picture. So today I decided to make a giant size peanut butter filled pretzel to satisfy not only myself but everyone who loves those delicious but tiny morsels of peanut butter goodness. So the ingredients to make these giant sized peanut butter pretzels is some short crust pastry, some softened cream cheese, peanut butter of course, some pure cream, a few peanuts, some rock salt, some cooking salt, an egg and some icing sugar. So let's get started. The first thing I need to do is beat the softened cream cheese until it reaches a nice smooth and creamy consistency. To this I'm going to add the icing sugar as well as a pinch of salt and keep mixing until they're all nicely combined. Now I'm going to add my peanut butter and continue mixing. You'll notice that the mixture starts to get a little bit lumpy but that's fine, it'll all come together shortly. In a separate container I'm going to whisk my cream until I get to nice soft peaks and then add it to my peanut butter mixture and mix the whole thing until it's nice and smooth and creamy. So I have one sheet of short crust pastry here onto which I'm going to place a generous amount of the mixture. I think I'll use about two thirds of the mixture. I felt like adding some crunch to this peanut butter pretzel so I've just scattered some peanuts onto my mixture and I'm just going to press them in nicely using a butter knife. Then I need to brush some egg along the edges of the pastry and close in my giant pretzel using the second sheet of pastry. To get a nice seal on the edges of the pastry and to make sure that none of the filling pops out while it's baking, I'm just going to trim the edges of all the four sides using a nice long sharp knife. Once I've transferred my giant pretzel onto my baking tray, I'm going to give it a nice covering with the egg and then sprinkle my rock salt all over the top of my pretzel. This pretzel is of course an adult size giant one, so I thought I'll make a giant kid size pretzel using my third sheet of pastry as well as the last third of my peanut butter mixture. Finally it's off to the oven which has already been preheated to 180 degrees Celsius or 356 Fahrenheit for about 25 to 30 minutes until they're puffed up and golden brown. These smell so nutty and warm and are irresistible straight out of the oven. I hope you enjoyed watching me create this giant peanut butter filled pretzel. If you did let me know by giving it a like and commenting below. You can also connect with me on Facebook, Pinterest, Instagram and Twitter. Make sure that you're subscribed to my channel so you can stay up to date with all my recipes and creative cakes. I hope you give this recipe a try. I guarantee you'll be satisfied once you bite into the crusty pastry and get a mouthful of the warm peanut butter filling. I hope you tune in next time and as always, thanks for watching.